Uh, they're definitely an explosive offense. They've been putting up points the past two games like anybody else. Um, we just got to come out and execute. Uh, we're going to go over a game plan this week, whatever Coach Roberts draws up for us, and we just got to execute it at a high level and go out there and play with each other and play for each other. So I think I'm confident in our defense and what we're capable of doing. We just got to go there and shut it out. Sounds like the exact opposite of what you faced in Mobile. I mean, they didn't throw the ball very much at all, and everything was really physical. What what didn't maybe go quite as well in, in Mobile as you all thought it would? And then is it how hard is it to just adjust to something totally different? Well, like you said, the physicality that, of that game surprised us. Um, I want to say they came out and they, they punched us in the mouth and we had to strike back. Um, we just had to get it going in that game. We we didn't come out with a lot of energy like we should have, and we had to get it going, as opposed to this game where we need to come out energized and we need to set the tone early. So I feel like this week we just need to have that mindset that we don't need to take anybody lightly, and every game is like one game at a time. Uh, next man step up. We have a great we have a great team. We got great players on this team and we have a lot of players that can step up and, and execute at a high level. So I have no doubt that the guys behind them can come in and execute and do their job just like the players that are out. Uh, we just need to get better. We all need to be on the same page. If we're all right, we're all right. And if we're all wrong, we're all right. Everybody just needs to be on one accord, one one page, one 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 play. We all need to be on the same same level, same accord, and we'll be able to play fast and play to our abilities. You guys are one win away from um, clinching the Sun Belt Western Division. Um, how much do you guys embrace moments like this? Uh, this is a this is a very big moment for us. Uh, I was saying during the during the game before I had to, I had to pray for the team. I was just saying cherish the moment, <laughs> just take advantage of the opportunity because you don't know when it can be taken away from you. And you don't know how long you'll be playing this game. So for a moment like this, it'll be big. It'll be monumental for the rest of your life. As you were on the road for your first time since last year's schedule, what does that say about the road for this team? Um, we're trying to set the standard. We're trying to set the standard here. Coach Napier came in, and he's definitely changed things around for us. And we've we've bought into what he's what he's preaching and what he's believing, and we believe in him. So we just want to go out and win games for that man and win games for this community and this program. Now that y'all got the win against South Al, I mean, y'all can really see the finish line here. And is the, do you expect the focus to be even more? I mean, you and the other guys have been around here for a few years, and this is kind of what you've been playing for, this opportunity the next couple of weeks. Absolutely. I mean, we always have this this kind of in the back of our mind, but at the same time, you got to focus on one week at a time. So right now, all our focus is on beating Troy. Um, defensively, I feel like we've grown tremendous um, communication-wise, execution-wise, um, just running to the ball. I feel like guys are flying around a lot more this year than they were last year. Um, we just we just all are closer. We're a closer-knit group than we were last year, and I think that's going to show on the field as opposed to last year. Um, we just I, Last year, I feel like we certain aspects of the game we didn't execute where we needed to, and I feel like this year we've definitely worked on that. We've worked on our communication. Our, our, our bond is growing a lot. And I think that's definitely going to help us this year against Troy. Uh, he's definitely stepped up. Uh, he's At first, he was kind of slow learning the playbook. But now I feel like he knows it in and out. He's definitely uh, been been able to be great for us this game against South Alabama. He was in the two eye and the two technique fighting on a double team a lot of the game, and he definitely kept the the guard and the center off me for a lot. So I definitely think he's growing in himself, and more games he plays, the better athlete he'll be become. What was your reaction? Um, everything you've been through since you've been in Lafayette, when when you hear that y'all are starting to get votes in the poll and getting some of that national recognition, what what, what did that mean to you? Uh, it's just. Our hard work finally paying off. It's just a blessing for this team, a uh, blessing for this community and this program. Uh, it's just a great feeling to know that we're we're one of the top teams in the country and we're, we're definitely playing like it and the people are noticing and we're getting votes in. Uh, we just got to keep doing what we're doing and we'll go down and lower in the list and that's what we want.